Sanjan Saurav and welcome to this video series of Oracle Performance Tuning Tips. Uh, in today's video, I will talk about materialized views. So materialized views are a very good method for improving the performance of your system as a whole. So first I will tell you what is the difference between a view and a materialized view. So a view is like a window to your database. You The view doesn't store the data but it queries the tables it's the base table which the query access it uh, accesses it queries those tables and extracts the data and displays whereas the materialized view actually stores the data it whenever it has a refresh me mechanism refresh methods are there so whenever you refresh the materialized view it extracts the data from the base tables and loads in the uh, other memory space so whenever you query on the materialized view you will very get the result very fast so it is a good tool for performance improvement i will show you an example of materialized view so this is the syntax create materialized view we there is an option of uh, loading the data when you create you can uh, load the data when you create the materialized view or you can later load the data okay so i will later load the data so i will defer the uh, build of the data loading on the utilized view then refresh there are three mechanism refresh methods are there fast complete and force so the fast refresh method will just append the new data added to the database at the end of the materialized view whereas complete will entire remove the data old data and loads all the new data in the materialized view and force will first try the fast and then it goes for the complete refresh method is not successful so i will write the default refresh now i will write the query select star uh, i forgot to choose the name of the materialized view employee mv build def Word, refresh complete as select star from employees okay so the materialized view is now created so let's query the materialized view and check what we will get employee the code mv so no rows are selected so since we have uh, given the syntax build deferred so the data is not loaded but if we had given build immediate or we doesn't have given anything so the default will be build immediate and the data will get loaded and i have method of refresh now i will refresh show you how to refresh materialized view okay so there is a view mdbms and view dot refresh this is the procedure to refresh the materialized view. So I will give the name of the materialized view which is the employee underscore mv. Uh, then I will end and the procedure is successfully completed. Now let's check what is the data which we have got. Okay, so the data is loaded in the materialized view. So we have successfully completed, uh, created a materialized view. So there are many different, uh, uh, different. There are very different features of this materialized view. We can have different syntax in the uh, gives different syntax during creation of the materialized view. Uh, like we can create fast refresh uh, and force. So uh, in coming videos, I will show you uh, mo more detail. There are various constraint on the fast refresh. You have to create materialized view log. I will show in the upcoming videos so please subscribe and if you like please like and comment to this video thank you